Hello today in summer afternoon. Few secrets about this: how to understand your dreams, how to work with your dreams. Dreams? Can we believe in dreams? Yes, dreams are are from our subconsciousness, and there is a lot of important information in these dreams. Dreams not usually mean then something have to be happened exactly like in this dream. Dreams is mean symbolic message to you, message from your subconsciousness. How to understand this? Uh, yes, this is something, something from old shamanic methods in working with dreams, but there is also a lot of psychology, and I explain you this very easy way, the most possible to understand. I learned this simple method from my psychotherapy teacher, and is the method with using dictionary of symbols. Because there are a lot of symbols, archetypes, Jungian archetypes, and old existing for thousand years in our planet in different culture symbols. Then the best way is to, if you have dreams, think what what these kinds of elements from your dreams, symbols like animals, plants, heroes, situation is these situations or these animals or plants or colors have any connection if they have any connection with anything what is important in your culture this is number one this is something something from outside of this book yet but if you can't find, if you don't know easy answer, sometimes if you if you are aware of this, then uh, there are important symbols from your culture. This is sometimes enough to understand. But today we are living in the mix of different culture, and we have connection with different religions and traditions. And sometimes we like many of them, we reading ab about them. For example, I grew up in Roman Catholic culture, but I like Buddhism a lot. I have connection with Judaism too. Then I have knowledge about this culture and they affecting my subconsciousness. And this great mix, if you, are, if you are more educated, if you are living in more diverse uh, society, like in North America, for example, in Canada or in US, you can have in your dreams mix from different traditions including First Nation tradition, for example, too. And if you have a dream, for example, if you or visions or psychedelic experience and you want to understand this experience better, you can use these wonderful books or any other book these kinds of the, about this topic. And my psychology teacher recommend me to this, my psychotherapy teacher. We have just, just find this element of dreams from this book. And in this book, there are information about this, what this symbol 
means in different traditions. And you can read, just read this and you reading and so how about this way how I am doing this with my clients. I am reading this, just reading this to my clients and say, do you feel something? Do you feel any emotion? It's something what means something to you. Maybe this. Okay. For example, the bear in different culture and tradition means following things. And if you start feeling something because our subconscious mind is very strongly connected, is more strong, strongly connected to emotion than to logic. For this reason, sometimes only pure logic is not enough to understand this. If you started feeling emotions, this is answer from your subconscious mind. And this emotion telling you, yes, yes, this is something. This is something. This can be this, this connected to this, this meaning. This can be meaning. And this can be the easiest way to find very fast answer of symbolic meaning of your dreams. And we can use this also in shamanic practice. The role of shaman is connection, always was connection between our material, real, everyday world and spiritual world. And shaman have better develop this spiritual part. Every of us, all of us have this spiritual part, but shaman have stronger abilities to have having this connection. And there are three ways to connect with this spiritual spiritual world spiritual part of our world number one the best the highest this is search, searching for vision just close your eyes and feel what coming to your to your imagination what coming naturally not you not creating this by your logic mind you not creating this by your creative imagination this have to just came to you this is just simple this is not uh, not complicated if you get this if you try and get this you this way you have in the same moment you have feeling then it, this is not you who creating this you know this then this is not you who creating this this just coming and this just watch what coming strike to remember this and after start to analyze these symbols and meaning. Another way, also maybe more simple and also good, I think, because some shamans waiting for to have dreams about problems. It was also in Bible a lot about having dreams and getting answer in, uh, in dreams about this, what this what God would tell to you. Then <clears throat> you <coughs> going to sleeping <coughs> and before sleeping, you uh, just telling to yourself intention. I won't have tonight dream. This dream have to be answered for this question 
my personal or, or from my community, from my tribe, from my family. And uh, maybe not uh, in in beginning, or maybe it, it was happened, maybe you need more training, but maybe the same night exactly what is surely happening to me. Every night, if I say I won't have dream, I have, and this dream have connection to my question. Try this. Maybe this can be so easy for you too. And after this dream, sometimes it's difficult just using logic for, for, um, to understand. And I can recommend using the same method this dictionary for, for both, for therapists and for shamans. This dictionary is very good tool, which can maybe give answer faster than um, just uh, sitting and thinking. You can also, if you don't have dictionary like this, you can also strength, can try to find meaning um, in, just in Google, but uh, I will be not uh, too much, I, be, I, be not, I will not trust completely internet because there are different uh, information, not always professional, these kinds of dictionary is professional. There are real traditional symbols, but sometimes it's just guessing of different people. Then you have to be careful. But generally, if you understand symbols, you can use just internet too. There is also the last one, the lowest, <laughs> the worst, like I say, method to searching for vision and answer. Of course, there are psychedelics to do. Like I agree with Mircea Eliade, like I uh, already mentioned in other movie, then this is the lowest kinds of shaman who using psychedelics or who giving psychedelics to others instead of teaching how to find vision and how to find answer in your dreams without any chemicals. But if some people, if are desperate and can't find any other way, they don't have dreams at all, they are not able to get vision, they are trying psychedelics, and this way can find answer. Uh, maybe there is Another way yet to find vision, I forgot to mention this because, yes, uh, not everybody have abilities to go to uh, shamanic trance just uh, like this, <laughs> if one can have vision. The traditional method is to singing, dancing, and using drum. This way, we Cal like we closing a little bit our logic mind and opening more to the subconscious part. We're going to trance. In trance, we opening more to our subconsciousness. And after traditional um, shamanic from Siberia, from Siberia where word shaman coming. Shaman means person of knowledge. How shaman getting this knowledge? Dancing at night, long time, singing, using rhythmic sound of the drum. If going to, to during dance to deep, deep trance, falling down to the ground and have already this altered state of consciousness, 
without any chemical, chemicals, just by dancing. And in this state, started have visions. And this is also like dreams, no, but every, everything. This vision and dreams coming from the same part of, of our brain and uh, entering from spiritual world coming to our mind, to our consciousness, and they can be answer for problems in the world. Try this and share your experience or if you have your own method, which I forgot to mention, mention, let me know. Thank you. Bye.